live from WPRI 12, this is The Road Show, the place for what's hot and happening. You're having fun, eating well, and living life on The Road Show. This morning in the Roadshow Kitchen, we welcome Nordic Lounge, and their raw bar is here. It smells like summertime, and I just found out I'm standing with a, a fellow Swede over here. <laughs> Chef Steve Pearson joins me. We always get the whole, you know, everyone's all Italian in Rhode Island, uh -huh. except for me, and I found someone else. I'm sorry. Are you part Italian? <laughs> no. 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 Okay, no. cool. We're, we're, we're in the we're, same boat. We got it. <laughs> we're Viking all the way. Excellent. All right, what have you brought for us today, Steve? Today, we've got oysters we've got little necks and we've got cocktail shrimp beautiful you also have a couple lobsters there in the middle we do and I know a lot of people are familiar with uh, Nordic Lodge because of the all-you-can-eat lobster special correct that's all we do mm -hmm. um, it's eighty eight dollars per person um, we've been doing it for 33 years and uh, it's it's in demand and you were saying too, a lot of people think oh I, I can't eat that much but what happens when people actually get there once you come the first time, you leave extremely happy, vowing to return. And uh, it isn't just about how much you can eat, but what really sets people off is the fact that they can try so many different high-end foods. That's true. People watch, enjoy the positive energy, mm -hmm. and roam the grounds. There's fire pits, fountains, alpacas, draft horses. It's endless. It's just a, it's a total experience. Absolutely. So uh, talk a little, too, about this variety. Where are you getting your seafood from? Okay. The Little Necks come from Narragansett Bay. Mm -hmm. Approximately 20% of all hard shell Little Necks come from Narragansett Bay. Okay. They are known as the premium hard shell clam of the world. Mm -hmm. These oysters come from our local salt ponds, which could be East Beach, uh, Salt Pond. It could be... Uh, Brightman's Pond, okay? What we look for in an oyster is one with a deep cup, mm -hmm. okay? Because that holds more broth and a larger meat. Okay. Uh, we look for uniformity in size. We look for nice crisp edges that aren't chipped. All right, beautiful. You're going to tell us a little bit more about the rest of the seafood, too, coming up in a little bit. Back to you. Back to the kitchen. Will? That's right. We are back in the Rocho Kitchen. Steve Pearson is here from the Nordic Lodge. When you say the Nordic Lodge in Rhode Island, so many people know of the Nordic Lodge. They go there, they bring everybody and their brother and sisters, and they spend the day, and they get a great meal. What are we doing today? We're shucking little necks and oysters. Okay. All right. Yeah. These little necks are from Narragansett Bay. Oysters are from either the Salt Pond or Watch Hill. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. So a lot of the, uh, is most of the seafood that you serve at the, the Nordic Lodge from locally? Local as much as possible. As much as possible. As much as possible, correct. Um, all right, so let's go over some of the things here and the best way to, to shuck these. All right. These are little necks. Mm -hmm. There's a common myth that the small ones are called cherry stones. That's not so. Cherry stones are about that big. Okay. You wouldn't want to eat them on the half shell. You chop them up for stuffies, you put them in a chowder. The smaller ones are called little necks. Those are the ones that are... And, and what, that is, what, what is the difference as far as, as far as taste? Is that why you, you wouldn't want to... Well, no, it's the, it's the texture of the flesh. Okay. As they get bigger, they get tougher. Oh, all right. On the same token, the really small ones that are like this, they're no more tender than this size. Mm -hmm. This size gives you more meat. You okay. actually get more... You, get, you really get something to eat. Okay. All right, so the best way to, to open these, these little okay. guys up here. There's several different ways. Mm -hmm. The way I'm going to show you right now is from the back. Mm -hmm. Bring your knife in. You work it a little bit like this. Cut, there's a muscle here and a muscle here. Right. Cut the first muscle. Bring the knife around, cut the second muscle. Twist a bit. Bring the top Scoop it in. meat into the bottom. Cut underneath it so that when you go to slurp it up. So that releases it from the shell. That is correct. Okay. And then you do it. Right. We like using limes. I'm an advocate of lime instead of lemon. Yep. And I'll tell you why. When you use a lime, you get that citrus first and then you taste the clam or the oyster. Okay. If when you use a lemon, you get the citrus all the way through. Right. We like that. Some people like cocktail sauce. Okay. So. All right, so we've got all of our, our seafood ready to go. We're gonna put the sauce together in just a little bit. Back to you. Thanks, Meg. Still to come this morning on the road show, we will be back in the kitchen. Don't forget, you can find all about the Nordic Lodge on WPRI.com and uh, watch us enjoy some of this raw bar. We'll be right back. <laughs> We are back in the Roadshow Kitchen. Chef Steve is here from the Nordic Lodge. 
grub bar is what we're doing right now. It's squeezing out ketchup yeah, bottles is what we're said, doing. It, we, we were talking about this earlier. It smells like summer in here. It smells like the beach. It makes you want to go Freshly outside, sliced get outside. cucumbers. <laughs> it really does. All right, what are you going to do for us now? All right, we're making cocktail sauce. Okay. We start with Heinz ketchup. Okay. Heinz needs no further introductory. Definitely not. It's but the, that'll do it. That sound is a great intro. It's, it's the standard in ketchup. Okay? I'm glad you said it was the Heinz. <laughs> Five shakes of Tabasco. Found only on Avery Island. Mm -hmm. Five shakes. Louisiana. Yes. Love Tabasco. Okay. Mm -hmm. Black pepper, McCormick's, coarse ground. Okay, is always yeah, better. I was gonna say okay. it's pretty Use about there. a half a teaspoon or so. These aren't exact. If you like pepper, put in some more. Okay. Horseradish. <laughs> okay. Love horseradish too. We're gonna put in a little bit of parsley flakes. Mm -hmm. Yum. And a little squeeze of lemon. We're gonna you whip guys it up. Make this at, at Nordic Lodge? We do. We do every day. That is correct. But a little lemon squeeze in of half a lemon or mm -hmm. so. All right. Okay. Not, not too much. Don't make it overpowering. All right. Whip it together, and there's your cocktail sauce. And then you are good to wow. go. You are good to go. Okay. And you're gonna put it on. Uh, we're gonna put, put it on clam. We're gonna put that right in here. Yeah. All right. I'm so excited. To yes, try this. you can put that on I'm the clam. Really but excited. as I said earlier, I want you to try with just a little bit of lime juice. Right. Oh, just lime. See, like I always that. use lemon. Correct. But lemon can be a little bit overpowering, and you never get rid of it till the oyster's gone. Mm. With lime, you catch it first, then you get the oyster after. All right. So oh, wait, nice lime on way. the oyster or lime on the clam? Or both? Both. All right. Either or. The lemon All right. Hit, hit, so, me, hit me with a little lime. All right, what, I want you? You, what I want you to do here yeah. is close your eyes okay. and think of the sea. This is part of hazing. We're hazing. Okay. okay. A little yep. touch, of, touch of lime, not mm -hmm. too much. Close your eyes. Okay. Close my eyes. Think of the sea? Think of the sea. Go for it. All I'll, you have to do is watch your face, folks. Am I going to miss my mouth? <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Am I right? I'm in the ocean. Uh-huh. <laughs> she's, she's dreaming. She's dreaming. That's delicious. Uh, I've yeah. never even thought to use lime. Now yeah. I will. Yeah. Will? Right. <laughs> I agree with whatever you say. Uh, uh, hey, exciting stuff for the Nordic Lodge. Okay. You guys were also uh, featured on the on the Travel Channel, right? Two nights ago, we were on the Travel Channel, and that was very flattering. Uh, it was really, really cool. Uh, went nationwide. We've had calls from all over the country. Look at that. There you are. Yeah. So Those busy. are Alaskan crabs you just saw on the plate there. And you got okay. such recognition from them. Yeah. Yeah, we're flattered. We're flattered to be here today. One of, of the best buffets in the country. It's the only buffet with an all-you-can-eat lobster venue really? any, anywhere, at least in the Northeast. <laughs> but, but you guys serve more than just the seafood. I mean, we're featuring seafood today. Absolutely. You serve, serve more than the, but it, is lobster the number one thing on the, on the menu? It then? is one of the main draws. Yes, it is. Mm -hmm. But the Alaskan crab has become a main draw to many women. The desserts, we have imported Belgium chocolates. We have, oh, man. We have everything you name it. Now you're talking my game. Um, talking so a lot, of, a lot of people get either sidetracked or they come for that specific. Specifically, it isn't just about lobsters anymore. Mm -hmm. We have all certified Angus beef from filet mignon cooked right in front of the customers wow. to uh, prime rib. Okay, so that's you know sliced you're right there. The best. Oh yeah, we use only the best. This is the deal. I'm not trying to brag. But go ahead. You, you, every go single ahead. Time. This is your time. This is your time. Go for uh, it. All right. Listen. Every single item we use, if it's ketchup, it's going to be Heinz. Mm -hmm. If it's if it's hard shell clams, it's going to be from Narragansett Bay, from Rhode Island clam, who are, who are impeccable yeah. in the way they do their processing. Fresh all the time, individually inspected, on and on and on. Mm -hmm. Oysters. The lobsters are only hard shell, two claw. There is absolutely impeccable lobsters. Yum. This stuff doesn't come cheap. Right. It's at a price. And conse consequently, we have to charge for that. Right. But well, when it's anybody, all you can eat. Anybody that's been there appreciates that. The cleanliness, the quality of the food. You are getting the, the best. enthusiasm and passion of the staff that's good and stuff. the grounds. I mean, I you, know, you know the place. It's neat. You know the place. All, all right. right. Thanks so much for mm -hmm. coming in. Everybody in Rhode Island knows Lo Nordic Lodge. Okay, she's going to continue to eat. We are going to go back to the, uh, the Rhode Island Convention Center and 